Hello everybody, today's subject we are going to be talking about the loggerhead sea turtle. Now, before we start the video, I'd like to say today is my birthday. Well, the day that I have uploaded this on, the 29th is my birthday. The day of the recording is not my birthday, but the day I uploaded it is. So if you would go into the comments and wish me a happy birthday, I would be very thankful for that. But let's jump into the video. First thing I'd like to jump into is the amount of eggs that they lay. They lay up to like 150 eggs. It's some crazy number like that. So many that I wouldn't want to go and sit and count how many eggs they have. But unfortunately when some of the eggs hatch, the bigger like crabs and all the predators near the shore are going to try and take the baby turtles and eat them and we've also seen some incidents of people like taking the eggs and keeping them for themselves um and that's just not a great thing to do because they're an endangered species and we don't want them to go extinct when the mother sea turtles go to lay their eggs it is extremely hard for them to walk on the beaches because they do not have flippers that are meant for walking. They are meant for swimming. And it's almost like you trying to go on your stomach just using your elbows moving around. These turtles get their name because they have very large heads. These sea turtles are still endangered, but they are the most common sea turtle to find in the United States. If any species of the sea turtle were to go extinct, all these turtles have a purpose. The loggerheads like to eat a lot and they actually get rid of a lot of the jellyfish that um, are in the ocean. And I'm pretty sure that if these guys went extinct, you wouldn't like to be swimming in the ocean and getting stung by jellyfish every five minutes. There are many sea turtle centers around the world that will help the conservation of these turtles and they will try their best to help um, keep them alive and grow the population back. And if you're interested, I'm sure there are many places where you can go and buy things and the money goes to helping the turtles. And they, you can also donate to uh, help out some of the turtles and that would be a great thing to do if you wanted uh, to help out these little guys. If you have any more questions about uh, these sea turtles, please ask me them in the comments and I will reply to them.